All right, you want to get your TF2 looking like Minecraft? Follow this video. So the blocky textures that you see on TF2 are pretty simple to do, and it's kind of nice because you can see more of your screen and you get more FPS that way. So the first thing you need to do is download a uh, TF2 config, just a graphics config. This is not going to make your textures blocky, but it's going to lower them so you can get more FPS, which I recommend Chris's Max Frames, which is you could download here and then you want to put it in your auto exec, which you can easily make one in your TF2 CFG folder. Okay, so once you installed a uh, graphics config like Comangula or or Max or Max Frames because that one gives you the most FPS, which you could download off this website, which I'll put in the description. All right, there's a few commands in game: map filter, te map filter, light maps one, and map filter textures one. Uh, for some reason, these don't like exec into like every server, so you have to do them like manually. So instead of doing that, I made a command or I used a command. Um, to put it in a scoreboard so as soon as you join a server all you have to do is press tab to see the scoreboard and it will bring up map filter light maps and map filter textures so if you just copy this and put it in your binds or auto exec you can just bind tab to that and it will open up scores and it will set your textures to blocky okay so next you want to get your tf2 actually looking blocky which is used by nvidia inspector um, so this is a website I'll put in the description and so you want to download this one or this one uh, 1.9.76 author so once you download this or I don't really know this one you want to open it when you open up NVIDIA inspector it'll look something like this and it depends on what GP GPU you have which has to be a NVIDIA or GTX GPU well same thing but so it'll look like this and you want to click on settings so once you open up settings, uh, it will kind of look confusing, but you don't have to worry about any of this. You want to go to the top and type in Team Fortress 2. Now this will be all set to like default, but the what you want what you want to set is texture filtering, and this will be on zero, but it will be yeah it will be zero. But what you want to do is you want to scroll down and set it to 15, and this will really lower your textures to blocky. And you want to click Apply Changes. Um, you should be good. To making it look like like really blocky but sometimes for me it didn't really work at first like it was just a normal like uh for uh config like it just looked lower textured but it wasn't blocky or like lowered quality so i did more research and you want to go to anti a and if it's not um blocky for you um i went to anti-aliasing transparency super sampling and this will be set to off and you want to go down to replay mode all and then after i did that and clicked apply and then open up tt my textures were really blocky like you saw on stabby stream all right so this is what it looks like in game as you can tell it's very very blocky and pixelate pixelated which i like and hopefully that was what you're going for so as you can tell it's very uh low quality you can't even tell it's the death sign but yeah this is all it's all uh, mine. It looks like Minecraft, which I like playing like this, and so I hopefully that was what you're going for. So yeah, but yeah, that's about it. Um, it's really simple. So just install the FPS config, go to Nvidia Inspector, set it to 15. That should be do. That should be fine. If not, you want to set it. You want to set anti-aliasing to replay mo replay replay mode all and click apply. Close it, open up TF2, and you should be good. Thanks for watching. Peace.